Hey, what is going on guys? PG here, bringing you some black and white too. So I got a Wi-Fi battle here against... Uh, I, I have no idea how to pronounce the name, so I'm not going to even try. Just look up in the title. We'll have his name. So check, go to his channel, and you can battle them if you want. So, um, let's go. Alright, so I was just doing some random shit here. I didn't expect to be taking the picture. When I saw this picture, I went, alright, a picture! I mean, this billboard. I went, alright, let's go to the billboard. But then I didn't realize I'll get a picture taken. <laughs> that was an accident. So, I haven't had a Wi Fi battle in ages. In fact, I haven't uploaded many videos in a while, like in a week or two. I haven't recorded any videos, let's just say that, in a while. So, I'm sorry, I just feel kind of bored, you could say. Of uploading stuff so I'm just taking a little break because if you if you upload something when you don't feel like it you upload shitty quality and it will be just shit and I do not like that anyway let's go so I uh, here I have an OU team so all OUs I generally don't like it but I don't have any UUs or BLs or anything below that's here and this, my opponent is, is asked for an OU battle so yes so, looking at his team, the only threats I can see are Sizzle, generally, and his Dragonite. So, they will be big threats. I don't generally see the other Pokemon, but they can be threatening if they are used well. So, I was planning to start off with Blissey, but I went, no, that would be a stupid plan. What happens if he starts with something physical that might be ruined? That might ruin my plan. So, I just went, alright, let's start off with Heatran. Heatran scarfed. Let's see what I can do. So he starts off with Dragonite, which caught me off guard. I'm like, hmm, why does he want to start off with Dragonite? So I used Hidden Power Ice, and he sets up a DD. And I went, oh, okay, um, can I outspeed this thing? Because the majority of them aren't offensive because of my multi scale, but generally somewhat defensive. But, so knowing this knowledge, I know even if it doesn't have jolly nature, it, it will still be faster. And yeah, so I was faster. So he sends out his Snorlax, and I can't touch that thing because it's thick fat. So I withdraw to my um, Jellicent. Jellicent took that crit quite well. Like, <laughs> I think it was actually half. And yeah, so he used the Body Slam. I do not know why. Don't ask me. I do not know why. I guess he was predicting a switch, but I don't know why it would switch. And I used this Top Six, so I thought. Alright, hmm, it's a Snorlax, it might be a wallish Pokemon, so I'm going to poison it, and that might be good in the long run. And yeah, so he uses Earthquake, and now he knows I have to recover, so I can recover stall him, and this will be just a big waste of time for him, so... I predicted him to switch to his Jolteon, because Jolteon can take out Mr. Pringle quite, I mean, <laughs> Jellicent quite well, so... I went to my um, Don fan to predict this switch out, but he actually switches out to his Empoleon, which caught me off guard. I went, what? Empoleon? Seriously? So I went to um, back to Jelly Sense because I can just wall this thing so hard. And um, yeah, so Water Exalt actually um, which gets my health back. And I went, alright. So I go out to my Blissey, and Blissey will destroy this thing. And yeah, so. When I was thinking of this, I assumed it would be stupid for him to send out his Jolteon, so the safest option, I would say, is to set up my Thunder Wave, so anything that isn't Snorlax wouldn't like to be Thunder Waved, and I got a Sissel, which is rather nice, because most of my Pokemon are rather slow, so now having a pa paralyzed Pokemon, yep, I'm coming, um, it would be nice. So, I, yeah, set up... I have the opportunity to set up rocks, I went, why not? My Blue Sea has served its purpose, besides Jolteon and Empoleon, I really have no reason to keep it alive. So, I used Seismic Toss, he, he got a little greedy here, using the um, second Swords Dance, but in the end, it, it doesn't even matter, help him. So, if he wasn't greedy, he probably could have taken out my Blue Sea a lot earlier. He, I don't know, maybe, maybe not, I don't know. But, yeah. He got a little greedy there, so I don't think... Yeah, I think that second source has is rather useless. It, this thing is quite frail defensively. Though it does have max defense and max HP, it's still quite frail. And that's it, Bliss is down. So, next I send out my, um, Conqueror. So, Conqueror, um... I don't know, for some stupid reason I thought 
fighting or is this steel? And then I found out it doesn't. When all the shit, because I don't have any investments in H. I mean defense. I've got max HP. And when I realized that, I went, oh the shit, that was a bad move. Maybe I should have went out to Don Fan. And yeah. So next he goes out to his Jolteon, and alright, I don't. I'll predict his Thunderbolt because, yes, this seems to be an obvious play, and he does the Thunderbolt, which is nice. I didn't think he would do anything else, so he withdraws his um, Jolteon and goes out to his Breloom because it, that does resist the Earthquake, but this Earthquake was really powerful. Look at it. Takes it down to rather low health and I can finish it off with a super effective ice shard and that is rather nice so my sturdy is still intact so that's nice I like that sturdy up so if Empoleon, Empoleon really can't sweep me so he sends out his Snorlax I really couldn't I could hurt him but I really don't want to hurt him just now but he used the rest and I went oh shit this thing's a resto chesto isn't it no, I'm completely forgetting about the leftovers, so it's not a Resto Chesto. I assumed it was a Rest Sleep Talk set with Earthquake and um, Body Slam, so if I had a Gengar, that would have walled that thing so hard, but I don't have a Gengar. So next, he, so he sends out his Jolteon, I send out my Conqueror, and I went, alright, I'm just gonna father this thing. Let's just kill it. He used, I just used the Mac Punch, and it doesn't kill him, I went, alright, that did a decent amount of damage, and then he used the Shadow Bolt, which was a mistake for him, because now my Conqueror survives that, because it has max HP and max special defense, and I finish it off with a map Punch, and that is nice. So, my only Pokemon dead, I believe, is Blissey? Yeah, that, that seems to be it, so, I went, alright, I'm gonna just follow my, um, Empoleon. So let's use the Mark Punch, and does he predict? Yeah, he was trying to predict me switching, but I thought that would be kind of stupid. He can die. I'm not sure if that critical hit mattered. It might have mattered, but in the end, I, I did want to get rid of that um, Conqueror, so it really didn't matter for me. But So he uses the Hydro Pump, and the Hydro Pump is Torrents Boosted, and uh, for some stupid reason, I thought I'd survive that. Life Orb, Stab, Torrent Boosted, uh, that is pretty, pretty powerful. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Um, so next he sends out his final Pokemon, which happens to be Snorlax in my room, and I send out my um, Donphan. So it'd be stupid to send out Heatran because of Thick Fat. My Eruption wouldn't do much, and it'd be stupid to send out Jelly Sands because we're just gonna have a stupid stall battle. So I just, just hope my Donphan could um, hopefully take it out rather low HP, rather fast, and I sort of underestimated this thing. This thing is rather good. And there we go. So that sh is the game. Yes, that is the game. So I won 3-0. So <laughs> that's why I generally don't like using all or use. I want to use some you use, some, oh sorry, some you use, some end use maybe. Yes, I'm coming. And yeah. So that was a great battle. So thank you for watching. Please click on the annotation on my opponent's Pokemon to go to his channel and please click on and if you want to subscribe to my channel click on the Pokemon, my Pokemon annotation and you can subscribe to my channel so thank you for watching comment like and maybe subscribe and I'll catch you on the next video so till then see ya